Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to record from PowerPoint or how to turn a PowerPoint presentation into a video file. I have got hold of a video courtesy of TechSmith, um, which is copyrighted. I will be playing, showing you that video. The video explains how to record from PowerPoint. Thanks very much. Welcome to the Recording with the PowerPoint Add-in Tutorial for Camtasia Studio. The Camtasia Studio add-in for PowerPoint is a toolbar that allows you to easily record your PowerPoint presentations. There are three ways to access the PowerPoint add-in toolbar. Through the Camtasia Studio welcome screen, the task list, or through PowerPoint. If you did not enable the PowerPoint add-in when you first installed Camtasia Studio 5, you will need to do this, and here's how. Open Camtasia Studio and click on Tools in the menu bar, and select Options. Then select the PowerPoint tab and choose Enable PowerPoint Add-in, then click OK. When starting PowerPoint for the first time after you installed Camtasia Studio 5, you will see the welcome screen. You will also see that a PowerPoint presentation covering the basics of using the PowerPoint add-in has been opened. You may find it helpful to review this presentation as a quick overview. If you are using PowerPoint 2007, then you will need to click on the add-ins menu tab to view the Camtasia Studio add-in toolbar. In earlier versions of PowerPoint, you will see the add-in toolbar located at the top of your window. There are several options to choose from before you begin recording. If you have a microphone and a camera attached to your computer, you can choose to record audio and or camera video as you record the presentation by enabling these two options. If you choose to record from a camera, you may also choose to preview what your camera records by selecting the Show Camera Preview button. This option will provide you with a picture-in-picture -picture preview window. Selecting the Recording Options button will reveal the Properties screen, which will allow you to change the recording options for the add-in. In the Program section, choose the options that best suit your presentation. You can choose to include the mouse cursor and whether or not you want it highlighted. You also have a few options from this drop-down window on how you want to be prompted at the end of your presentation. The default setting will ask you if you want to stop or continue recording. The video and audio section will allow you to choose a video frame rate and an audio source. If you click on the advanced button, you can further set up your camera and microphone. Note that in the audio options section, you can access the audio setup wizard which will help you set up your audio, including the audio input level. When finished, click OK. If you like to use hotkeys to start and stop your recordings, adjust the hotkey properties at the bottom of this window. Once you have adjusted your settings, click OK to return to the PowerPoint main screen. If you haven't already, open the PowerPoint presentation you wish to record. Click on the Record button in the Add-in Toolbar. This will automatically launch the presentation in slideshow mode. By default, the recorder will start paused. Click the Click to Begin Recording button when you are ready to begin. Your slideshow is now being recorded and you may give your presentation as normal. All the slide changes, transitions, and animations will be recorded. Also worth noting is that everything you do as part of your presentation is being recorded as well. Your recording will end automatically when you reach the end of your presentation. To stop the recording earlier, you may use the Escape key or the hotkeys Control Shift F10. Unless you change the settings in the add-in options, when you end your PowerPoint recording, you will be prompted to stop the recording or continue on. Continue to record your presentation if you want to show something else on your screen. This is helpful, for instance, if you want to demonstrate an application or show something that is not in your PowerPoint presentation. 
If you choose to continue recording, there are two ways to stop the recording, either by pushing Control Shift F10 or by clicking on the Stop Recording button found on the PowerPoint Add-in toolbar. Once you've stopped recording, you will be asked to save your recording. After that, you may choose to produce or edit your recording. Choosing to produce your recording will take you directly to the production wizard within Camtasia Studio. While editing your recording, we'll place your recording in the Camtasia Studio timeline. This completes the tutorial for the PowerPoint add-in toolbar. Thank you for watching this video. I would like to thank TechSmith for their video. Please comment, rate, subscribe to keep up to date.